Hello. Hello, Mr. Mowiri. Yeah, okay. Uh, we are getting there. So we start with the uh, so is that okay? Yes. All right. So it's Kwanele what Muziani? Mazinyani. Mazinyani, okay. Yes. All right. Hello, good afternoon and good evening, Mkoma Masimba. Here we are as a follow-up from yesterday. Yesterday we had uh, a show on mentorship. And uh, in that show, uh, someone called Kwanele Muzinyani Mazinyani. Yep. Uh, she indicated that she was going to be a member of C2C and she followed up by actually joining and paying her member dues. So she paid yesterday, and this morning uh, I spoke to you about it. And just to draw lessons from what we discussed yesterday and what happened from yesterday to today in relation to Kwanele Masnyani. So good evening. What time is it there? Uh, right now in Melbourne, Australia, it is uh, 20 past 9 p.m. on a Wednesday, uh, the 7th of October. All right. It's still the 7th there. He is still the 7th as well. Uh, 2020, the unique year that shall be remembered in years to come. So from yesterday, what did you learn from uh, Kwanele as Yani? You have known her for some time. Well, I haven't met Kwanele in person. I met Kwanele after I started writing book ribbons. She fell in love with the book ribbons. At the same time, she got emotional. Uh, she also went emotional just because she remembered me from Macheso, Baba Sharo, who was in Melbourne in Australia back then for a show. She told me, she remembered me, I bought a beer, then I took it to the VIP room. And I said, wow, thank you for that. I'd forgotten about that one. I met lots of people that day. Thank you for remembering me. Then she offered to help me. I'm Koma Masimba. I can't let you be broken. I can't let you be down on the streets. I want to offer you accommodation. Then I said, no, my sister, thank you. At this stage, I'm fine. I'm the boss. I'm in charge. I'm on the streets. I want to clean up myself. So basically, she drove all the way to come to where I used to hang around. To make, she made that extra effort again. After I denied her help, she drove to come and see me. She came to my local area. I wasn't there. Then she met Frank from Uganda. She stayed around for about an hour waiting to meet me. Until today, I haven't met her, but she showed me effort. Again, she came back and said, Goma Masimba, I'm supporting Bugre Benzi. I'm paying $30. So I've learned. She's a very true friend. She highly values me. Her help, her intention to help me was genuine. She paid $30. Okay, before She's paying, my dear. before paying, uh, she became your connection on social yes. media. Yes. Had you, had you not uh, included your book about uh, your sickness or alleged sickness, what do you think would have happened? Would she have reached out to you? No. So you managed to convert a connection unknown to you, but none on social media, into a community. Correct. 
So you didn't have to pay, she didn't have to pay anything for her to say, I know you. And she took the next step of ensuring that whatever you are doing, you are okay, you are catered for. And if you need anything, it's not a hotel, it's not anything, but uh, you can count on me, you can bank on me, I'm your sister. Correct. And there was nothing suggesting that you needed any sexual favors or anything. Correct. So this is one lesson. What they call it, when I was talking to uh, Tinashe earlier on, Jonasi, uh, he was saying citizenship, you need papers to be a citizen. You need papers to be married. How many people have papers, yet they don't sleep together, yet they don't even talk to each other? A lot. So da, does the possession of papers give you identity as alleged by Mr. Tinashe Jonas? Nope, it's very wrong there. But do you think he was wrong or he's alone in connecting papers to identity? He's not alone. That's why my book is called Book Rebels. There's a lot. I was one of them, but I learned. That's where my anger came from. After I learned, I shared by writing a book, Book Rebels. So identity has got nothing to do with citizenship. I was watching your show. You asked it a very good question. What if you are born on the airspace? That was a good question. And what so did he Mr. say? Donald. Did he answer that question to your satisfaction? He didn't answer question. He never answered your questions. He failed to answer all your questions. I was watching the interview, the mentorship. Okay. But did you know that I didn't know you were watching until you started typing, you stepped forward? Yes, because I was watching in silent. Then I started typing. How many people join groups and they are silent. Nobody hears them. How many Hello. politicians refuse to answer any question or to expose their ignorance until Hello. they assume public office? Right now, a matter of fact, I've got 30 people watching live, but I'm only getting one comment per 10 minutes. That's they're right. not participating. They're just in silent. They're just in silent. You know, I'm telling them I'm the boss, I'm in charge, and they're quiet. They're not hitting me back. And I'm telling That's them I'm your prophet. They're just quiet. So I'm provoking them, and they're just quiet. So I'm the boss. I'm in charge. Do you, do you find that in any grouping of people, a number of the people in any group choose not to be noticeable, choose yes. not to be visible. Correct. And yet people like Tinashe, because they don't have a presidential job, they are available. Correct. And then he may learn, as he said, you want to know what he said after the show? Yes, please. Okay. Let's... Uh, Let's uh, play it first, and uh, before we get into the into the uh, the, the the other matter of Kwanele uh, and uh, uh, so this is uh, Tinashe Jonasi. And uh, uh, did you enjoy the show with him? I enjoyed. I learned. Did you? Enjoy? Okay. Yeah. There may be people who are watching now who also were part of that. Uh, maybe let's uh, play so that. Uh... That show answered okay. my question. Pogrebins. Who is Benzi Mukoma Masimba? What is a Benzi? 
Do you think that question is uh, valuable? Yep, Tunesh, Tunesh answered my question. Who is Benzi Mukoma Masimba? What is Benzi? Tinesh Jonas, go watch your show again. That is Benzi. Not me. All right. He, a suit. he was wearing a suit. He was very, looking nice, speaking very good English. I'm just here sitting homeless man waiting to go to a hotel. Who is Benzi Mukoma Masimba? Okay. What is Benzi? I was watching the show. It answered my question. What is Benzi? What is Benzi? That's where okay. this book is sitting. That's my content. What? What is Benzi? Mm -hmm. So let's have that. Uh, uh, okay. Yeah. This is any development, development comes from me. Okay. So was it a worthwhile hour to. I, I, it's a lot because you need to be challenged. In, 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 you, you don't need a comfort zone. Yeah. You need the disruptive psychology is, is good. All right. You think you are you are a leader of a party or something, you need to be questioned and then it it it, 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 it makes you start it, it create other new perspectives of leadership of, of your leadership. All right. So do you think the question what is a leader is pertinent? Very much. Because you remember Mr. Mawe, the wisdom is sharpened during discussion. But you did you discover that there are people, people who actually, actually think there is a relationship between merit and leadership. Yes. Right? That, that, that right. if you if you have a master's degree, PhD or undergraduate degree, if you've been a CEO, then you are better equipped to be a leader than somebody who has never gone to school. Yes, that's why I'm saying a discussion provokes, provokes a, a perspectives, narratives, and a whole lot of things. A discussion is there to kickstart, you know, otherwise if we don't, if I just start for an examination and I don't write an examination. I, I want to know at what which level is my my my, my, my acquired you know, is, is, is preparation. But in the continent of Africa with fifty four heads of state and government, do you think uh, this question has ever visited their minds? What is a leader? No, 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 no. They don't. They, well, they, they, they define leadership into manipulation of votes to, to be in the office. Once they are in the office, that's the definition of a good leader. Because you have, you have beaten other candidates. All right. We were talking in the Towards Media Excellence Group. I shared with you the thread. I, maybe you have not gone through it. The one I sent you, it started with an audio of uh, the, the, what? the thread that I sent to you. But why don't you listen to that? Then we can take it for the, after you go through it to see where the problem is. No, no, no problem. All right. Hello. 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 Yes, Mr. Mowiri. Yeah. Right. So that clip, that interview, you and Mr. Tinasha Jonas. Yeah. It's answering my book. It's answering my question. It's answering my anger on the question, what is Benzi? Yeah. He never answered any question there. The questions were simple and straightforward. He tried to run away from a simple question identity versus citizenship. He was given an example of a lion, animal kingdom. Then he said, correct, which is a fact. He's forgetting again. Human beings are also living creatures. So I'm being answered now on what I've learned. So I'm showing you, Mr. Maweri. I was like them before. 
That's me there. That's why I came back to you to show you what I've learned. No wonder why I said you are my mentor. That's why I need so, you at this no, stage. If you look at I need you, then we need each other. What is the difference? The difference is I need you. For me to need you, you have to need me back. I have to value you. But then you do value you me are, back. Then we become that, we. After you, negotiating. That, that, that is a retelling. Because anyone who needs me would have to have one-on-one -on -one relationship. Imagine if a class of 40 people. Yes. And each pupil, each student needs you one on one. Then you got 40 different Facebook lives. Mm -hmm. Which one would you go to and why? That's a very good question. Of course, one on one. One on one is expensive because you will have to multiply yes. yourself. Imagine yes. there are 10, 10 people who say, Maware is my mentor. Yes. And uh, they all want to be mentored genuinely to improve their chances at life. Excuse me, Mr. Maweri. I have a question for you. I haven't seen anyone who said he's your mentor. So at this stage, you've only mentored me. I'm the first to come out and say, you are my mentor. No, After you may that, not. No, if you ask the question, then, and you want to know the answer, then you would ask, Mr. Mawere, is there anyone else who is like me who wants mentorship? Then the answer will be easier. Mm -hmm. Do you understand? Correct. Correct. Okay. This, this is one person uh, who says uh, a, a same thing, same idea, and the same civilization. So if you read there, I don't know where that comes out. Mm -hmm. I can see now. Yep. What what does it say there? I believe in you, Mdara, in you, Hangum Mdara. I've been to your offices several times. I've learned a lot there from your lectures. You are better than university lecturers. Not meaning that they are useless, but mm, so testimony. Let's, uh, Let's uh, let's have uh, the anuti part. So, if you look at what he is saying, uh, he says, uh, "Okay, let's see the continuation." I mean, I don't, I don't mean. Yep that they are useless, but good. I wish to learn more from you. You understand? Yes. So, and then I have to have the same question and uh, we take it to the next level and uh, this person wants to learn. And then I tell him, no, I'm, I only have time from Koma Masimba. But he wants to learn. What should I say to him? And I can give you more of the people that are there. Huh? Now, I would like to sign a contract with you, Mr. Mawiri. This contract, I would like to refer everyone. I would like to be your agent for those who want to learn. They'll come through. Come on, Masimba, programmings or hashtag C2C. 
then I will but take it from there. You are already departing from from that. Uh, if you, you if you say <clears throat> we want to learn and we want to organize ourselves like what uh, Kwanele has done, which is that's my conversation with her today. Uh, yes, uh, uh, she got the audio. No worries. Okay, thanks for the clarification. Does it make sense to you, Kwanele? Yes, makes a lot of sense. Good initiative. Do you want to be part of it? Yes, this thing is I wouldn't have time at all. I have school and work hardly even on social media. However, you are welcome to send me correspondence and I'm happy to put any kind of input in building C to C. Just being part of a community, Kwanele, that you can leverage on when you need to may be an end objective without asking of you to do anything. Then I ask you, did you notice the difference in understanding on what C2C is and is not between me and Mkoma Masimba? That's Kwanele. So Kwanele is now, uh, is busy, but she's trying to answer. That is the question. What this is... is there. Yeah, we, let's have a understanding there. What that's is C two C? That's so. If we are we are now going to that route, we now need to have the same understanding of C to C or a shared understanding, not the same, yes. because yep. we can never be the same. So mm -hmm. let's hear Thank what uh, Panele is saying. Uh, so you can say a few words now, then I take the audio to panel. Yep. Uh, panel, I want you to listen carefully. That is the Jonas Obadara. Remember, okay, means we have to see to see. I want you to see this diagram. Okay, I'll simplify for you. Wapadra teji pasiyango. Mari we padro nai, right? Mari yenda kusi juice. Kwa ya yenda after wa wudi na, wosa pote ni mguva basi. Na wugu tipeo, wisha mari yangu. Okay. So there you are saying wasa pote ani. We agree with you. Use chassis. Okay. Yeah. All right. Uh, uh, you, uh, you have supported Mkoma Masim, but not supported yourself in being part of the community funding program where okay. each one of us pays the same amount so that no one would own the community on account of paying. But if you want to help me outside the sea to sea, by all means, you pay more. The $30 goes towards building community power. The balance comes to me that, uh, to me through the same payment gateway. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah, correct. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. So... We now go back to uh, this. Uh, uh, so let, let's see. Then I will see to see. Wait a minute. Then see to see you are you on board. But I won't for growth down. What a number was still here. Sakai will marry a number of your own city to see what keeps it up. In the America, or see to see less an online payment. Somebody look America, you paid in Australia, you went into America. Saka, why can't we just tell the city to Maria about the one Columbus in the Australia? So no, in some way, my young. 
So you are talking now of two different ideas. One is the payment gateway. Another is the payment to belong to C to C. So the two are not the same. Mm -hmm. So the first one is I want to build. How do I pay? I'm at home. What is the most convenient way for me to pay? When I go to Woolworth, I may pay by cash, I may pay by card. Correct. But after paying, I'm allowed to take the goods with me. Correct. So the payment is one thing. Mm -hmm. The belong the the decision to belong is another to say I am a mentee. If there are other people out there who want to be mentored, mm -hmm. even Correct. to interview a person like Tinashe Jonas, mm -hmm. how do I become the best in my own craft? Mm -hmm. So I then say, let's build a center for excellence on journalism. Mm -hmm. And Mkwama Simba will be the one who conducts it to only the people who are interested mm -hmm. in journalism. Mm -hmm. So we run workshops, seminars, webinars, yes. so that those who want to perfect their skill can then come there as members of C to C. So we can call on the president to say, President, we want to have a conversation with you as part of building a literate community. And how do we build literacy? By sharing that people who have learned a lot, even Kwanele, when she listens to this, she will learn a lot as well. Correct. At first, I want to belong. The second, then how best can we build communities that are convenient to us? You may end up knowing me miles away that no Kwanele who is close to you can drive to you. Correct. Yeah. So when you die today, I don't have to fly there because we know we have Kwanele and others. Rasta, all these people that you have introduced. So those who have paid who belong to Australia, we say, why can't we have C to C representative, not an agent of Maweri? Correct. But a bank representative. So you become like a cash agent. Mm -hmm. You can receive money, you can pay out money. So why do I need to the, go to the bank if Mkoma Masimba is now my new bank? Mm -hmm. So those who want to send money to Zimbabwe, instead of approaching me directly, they just put money there. Somebody in Zimbabwe gives money to somebody. So that's sending and receiving money. Correct. Yeah. Then some may want to invest and they are getting lower returns from the bank. Then I know Mkwama Simba can also do the same, which is like what we did with David Tsatsa, who is on Australia, contacted me and I referred him to you. And he told me a success story that what I ended up buying my own trucks. Now I'm expecting funding, but he's a nurse. Mm -hmm. I've not met him. Mm -hmm. And all I say to him, just pay your membership fee so that uh, tomorrow, if Mkwama Simba is not there, somebody else can give. That's what mm -hmm. I was saying. But your side was no. And the so why should I pay $30? Another person may ask. So let's go ahead.
Yeah. Okay. You heard that. Yeah. Yeah. All I can say in summary, I said, you have supported me. You are saying, Kwanili, you have supported yourself. Am I getting you there? That's where no, I'm trying to say, okay, now we are together now. Now I hear you. All right. So at least we are getting somewhere. Mm -hmm. So what is the difference? Kwanili, you supported me. Mkoma Masimba wanna support you, then she paid the money. Finally, you supported me. This is like a pedestrian now. Let's go deeper on that one. Yeah. Statement. So, Finally, you supported me. I'm talking as a Zimbabwean. You supported a cause that you believe in. You, you didn't that's support me. Now. That's quite now. You're speaking that's on what, quality side now. Yeah, that's what yep. you, are, you are saying. That's why I asked the, do, do you, I, do you want to be a member? And she said, yes, but I may not have the time. So at least she is a member. Mm -hmm. You see? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So what's the difference? So she supported me only. That's all she did. Then she went quiet. Yeah. yeah. So I'm correct. The boy who supported yeah. me, because he said I'm only you going know, to pay for Bugatti. Well, just to watch you, then you are just using as a payment gateway to say, uh, "Send me money through my cousin, and I will receive the money from my cousin." But if she's joining in her own right, then she is entitled to make her own choice to be part of something or not to be part of it. Yeah. So that now you see, Mr. To yeah. you to see now, Mr. Mwere, that's where now you and I now, that's where our relationship is. She paid $30. Just, she just want to watch the shows, the shows that I do on my personal page, right? Or on my personal capacity. Yeah. Right? That's what she wants to watch. That's what she wants. So I said, okay, if you want to watch those shows, the subscription fee, $30 per year. Then she paid. Yeah. What I do with that money, that's my business. Yeah. No, no. You have to ask here, do you, have you paid just to watch the shows? And how many shows? But she, if she's has paid an annual membership of C2C, then she will be on, uh, on the database of C2C is a paid up member. Mm -hmm. But if she's she doing for it, it, yeah, she paid for she paid because she's playing a role. Then, yeah. then he, it means if you die today, what happens to what she has paid for? That's the end. Yeah, so she is a reality show. She must agree what she prefers because it's her own money. She didn't get it somewhere. She mm -hmm. worked for it. And even if it's $30, mm -hmm. it's a small amount of lunch. You can decide to eat lunch or you can decide not to eat lunch. But once you have made a decision to be part of something, that's your choice. It's not about the amount of money. But give you the choice to make which means we have to share with Kwanele so that she clarifies whether she's joining solely to be part of Book Rebenzi or she wants to be a member of this community building. So Where basically, I'm saying to Kwanele now, so basically you are saying, Kwanele, you have paid for Book Rebenzi. There's an extra package which comes from Book Rebenzi that is C2C. Yeah. Are we talking about the retail market uh, jargon? No, there, there are people who want to buy the book and who don't want to be members of any community building because they feel mm -hmm. an attachment to you. 
So you must give them the opportunity to say yes or no. Mm -hmm. But don't bundle it together. So there are people like mm -hmm. you who have to give up time to be on air. And uh, that time needs to be compensated for because while you're on air, you can't do other things. Mm -hmm. So it's up to a person like Kwanele to make that decision. But don't make it for her. Explain things properly so that she understands that, yes, uh, I am a member of C2C openly where I can also contribute. Yep. Then I got a call, Mr. Mwere, just uh, before this show. I am Koma Masimba. I'm enjoying Bugari Beans, and I'm also learning a lot from Mr. Mawiri. I'm I'm on. Uh, I'm in need of emergence uh, help. Please, can you connect me to Mr. Mawiri? Then I replied, "Thank you very much. I can only meet Mr. Mawiri live on Facebook. For you to be part of this uh, Bugari Beans, you have to pay thirty dollars per year." Then I'll try my best. Then he said, no, I don't even have a cent. I'm just simply asking, say, a fan of Bugri Beans to hook me up with Mr. Maweri, please, as soon as possible. I'm going to WhatsApp number here. Right. Now, Twitter say now. You need to build a yeah. bridge. So what I'm saying is, uh, yeah, now America, a I'm lesson I'm day, a you can also learn. Imagine. Send you a message. Mm. America, and I'm boxing the message. No, no, I'm saying is imagine I, yeah, imagine I had to meet everybody who wants to meet with me. What kind of life would I have? I would have to be permanently mm. on social media. Mm. So that's what you're saying. Find where you can belong to a community. You may find that what you want to talk to Maweri about can be resolved where you are. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so why don't you wait where you are, find other people? Because Maweri is just a person of flesh and is also a sinner like you. So why do you want to talk to Maweri for Maweri's ears to hear? I want you on my show for me to tell me so that I can demonstrate why we need to be organized. So that's what my show is about, to be a bridge. So come to yes. my book, because there are many people like that person who are also saying, I want one-on-one. -on -one. Imagine you are the president of 10,000 people. How would you deal with 10,000 people one-on-one? -on -one? Mm -hmm. hmm? So how do you answer that question when someone comes to you, Mr. Maweri? Please, I also want one on one. I can do better than Benz and Mugupa Taimiro. How do you answer that question? You just take the audio here, the link, and send it to the person because we have already responded to the person. Mm -hmm. So, in this show, we have already responded. So, you just take the link and send it to them because then they will find a discussion of that you have sent the message. And what I have said to you, that the best price is not one-on-one. -on -one. It's more expensive on me. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes. So you don't have to go further. Yes. Then say, please be part of Bungure Benzi, but be a member. Mm -hmm. So that the questions that you want to pose to Maweri, can actually be addressed without Maweri being alive. Yep, yep. Mm -hmm. Yes. I see the bridge, C to C. Yeah, Lugi Bata. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'm learning. I've learned. I learn and learn and learn again. That's it. Mm -hmm. All right, Mr. Mawiri. Are you? Do you have any other shows today? No, no. I think this is uh, my maybe later on. Yeah, maybe I'll try you later on the. We call it the night riding, the night riders. Yeah, the graveyard. That's right. Yeah, the graveyard show. 
I know that I'll try All around right. 10 o'clock. Thank okay, you very thanks. much. Okay, bye.